Welcome back to this channel for practice problems for actuarial exams. My name is Krzysztof Ostaszewski. You can find information about me at smarturl.it forward slash Jedi. My advice on how to pass actuarial exams is at smarturl.it forward slash pass. This video channel is at smarturl.it forward slash pass actuarial exams. You can find information about online seminars and study manuals for exams PFM, IFM, and LTAM that I offer at these links that I give here. I direct the actuarial program at Illinois State University. You can find information about it at smarturl.it forward slash actuary. If you would like to offer a tax-deductible donation, at least tax-deductible to the extent allowed by law, to support our students at Illinois State University, please go to smarturl.it forward slash help ISU actuary. Here's a problem for today for exam FM on financial mathematics. A 30-year bond with a par value of 1,000 and 12% coupons payable quarterly is selling at 850. Calculate the annual nominal yield rate convertible quarterly. So note that the coupons are actually paid quarterly, which means that uh, these are three coupons of 3% per uh, quarter. And the par value is 1,000, so the coupons are 3% of 1,000, so they're 30. In order to solve this problem, it's most convenient to find the effective quarterly interest rate first, and then from it the annual nominal rate convertible quarterly. So it's called that uh, effective uh, quarterly interest rate uh, j, and j is equal to i upper 4 over 4, but that's the same as 1 plus i to the 1 fourth minus 1 because 1 plus i upper 4 over 4 to the 4th is equal to 1 plus i. So we have this information in the problem, that 300a angle 120 at j plus 1000 times 1 plus j to the negative 120, that's, that's basic franc formula for the price of a bond, and that's equal to 850. And now using a financial calculator, we can calculate what J is. It's approximately 3.5391784654%. So for example, if you have a BA2 Plus Pro, which is the calculator that I use, um, you get this result by entering 120 for N, 30 for PM, uh, payment PMT, uh, negative 850 for uh, present value, 1000 for future value, and then you compute IY. And the negative number comes from the fact that the calculator assumes that you're um, paying off a loan, but this is not a loan, this is an asset, hence this uh, need to do this. Um, I would also say that uh, if you get confused and enter 850 as a positive number, you, you will get that uh, the calculator can't solve this then just try it with a negative number. Um, change the number to negative and you will get the right result. So the nominal annual yield rate convertible quarterly is 4 times uh, j, and that's i upper 4. And the question asks us to find i upper 4. And i upper 4 is equal to 4j, which is 4 times the number which is found, and that's approximately 14.15671386 percent, and that's answer c. Please remember this is copyrighted material. The problem comes from Society of Actuaries. The solution is mine. Good luck in your studies and good luck on the test.